from Los Angeles, where the second largest Jewish population on Jewish Community Night. Uh, we are uh, helping out the Jewish community today by uh, giving them a taste of a uh, ballpark frank. Now, it's, it's, today is uh, Jewish Community Night at Dodger Stadium. That's right. Ordinarily, do they have kosher food at Dodger Stadium? Uh, more importantly, it's Sandy Koufax bobblehead night, but... Uh, it rarely have kosher food here at Dodger Stadium. It's basically a once a year event. And this is the first year that we're selling fresh made hot dogs in the stadium. And what exactly are you selling tonight? Uh, we have um, uh, regular Jeff's kosher dogs, uh, Jeff's jalapeno dogs, and uh, Polish sausages, all homemade locally in L LA. Kosher, 100% beef. All 100% beef, kosher, supervised, from the best stuff on earth. Now, is it only for Jewish customers, or do you think? Uh, uh, I think the quality of our product transcends uh, religions and cultures and races. So no, yeah, I mean, I think it's uh, if people want a good quality uh, hot dog for a reasonable price, they should uh, come by to the Jeff's kiosk. What's the possibility of having it more than once a year? Um, that depends on how well we do tonight and uh, how much you know the uh, community at large uh, likes our product. So, How much is your hot dog selling for? You know what? I'm not sure. Well, it says there's a kosher dog is $8. $8. How does that compare to the price of a regular Dodger dog? So a uh, Dodger dog is um, uh, $5. And a uh, Super Dodger dog is six fifty, but uh, you know you're paying a little premium for not the uh, for none of the extra stuff that you might get in a uh, non-premium hot dog. So that's where the difference lies. What are uh, dietary observant Jews supposed to do? This is America's number two uh, most populous Jewish city, Los Angeles, right? Yeah, uh, I believe it is. Um, you know, it's it's starting to the trend is starting where ballparks around the country are starting to offer kosher kosher food more on the East Coast uh, you know it, it, it really is more uh, the responsibility lies on the consumer to want it and to ask for it and uh, and we're here to offer it so if uh, you know if there's a demand we'll be there to uh, to get to get it out what kind of awareness is there among people here in the ballpark that there is a kosher uh, stand well we had about three weeks to uh, get this ready to go from uh, from the time we were told that they want to do this to today, it was about three weeks. And uh, we did a pretty good job at getting the word out, Facebook, Twitter, um, you know, all the major Jewish but is there publications. Any, is there any announcement or anything in the stadium? Are they going to I, uh, I don't know if there's a major announcement. They haven't told me. Uh, we hope for the best, but uh, you know, it's just, it's uh, more or less uh, word of mouth and uh, kind of a grassroots uh, campaign on our part. From Dodger Stadium in Los Angeles, California, for YouTube, this is Scott Jacobs reporting.